I joined pretty much because of 9-11. I, mean, I always wanted to be in the service. Uh, something I've known since I was a kid. Uh, I guess 9-11, you'd say, is just kind of a catalyst for that. Uh, you know, I, like everybody, every other American out there, you know, I remember that day I was in high school when that happened. That I knew then that's the road I was going to be on. Uh, so I joined the Army. Uh, infantry I wanted to be a fighter uh, I just I knew I wanted to be out there on the front and so I was a uh, ended up moving through and did pretty well uh, ended up being promoted going to sergeant uh, took over a squad uh, been everything from a team leader squad leader section leader weapon squad leader and uh, I really enjoyed it, you know, it was a highlight of my life. There are challenges and coming home, so it, you think it's gonna be just, you know, going home, but it's, it is different. Uh, the jobs, especially when I got out, they just, <laughs> they weren't there. I mean, they, there was work, but it's not the kind of work you wanna do it as a career. And, you know, the things you're looking for, they're hard to come by and you got, 1,000, 1,500 people all vying for that same job when something does open up. So it was really competitive and it's, you know, it's just challenging trying to start out. So, you know, you're starting out at life where most people start out in life, you know, right out of high school, 18 years old, you know, and they just build on it. You know, when you get out of the military, you know, you're already middle age or pushing middle age or even beyond that. So, I mean, it's, you're starting out way later. You know, I had kids when I got out. So I had a lot, a lot more riding on it. Seven Eagle actually kind of just stumbled upon them. And uh, so I was you know, looking on the internet, trying to find jobs, uh, you know, seeing what was out there. And uh, I found one for a production supervisor and I, it was close by, I liked what I was seeing with that. And uh, when I reached out about the job, I ended up, it was being, you know, it was advertised through Seven Eagle. A thing that only other veterans can understand. And it's the thing that bonds them together uh, as tight as family. And uh, so that's the thing, you know, when you come out and you work with a company like Seven Eagle, it's so much different than just, you know, if you were going to uh, like just a placement company, just like a standardized placement company where you're just being run through by the numbers, like here, come fill this out and we'll go, we'll call you when something happens. But the way Seven Eagle does it is so different because it, they are run by veterans, other veterans like myself. and. You know, they understand who you are and where you're coming from. They've been there themselves too. So they actually, they don't just take you and put you in a system and just run you by the numbers. They actually work with you in the whole process, start to finish, unlike any other thing that I've ever done or experienced. And it, it was really, really amazing to me to see how far these people are willing to go to help you. Uh, people like Jordy Kern, who's the founder, the owner, yeah, you know, he's, you know, most businesses you never see or hear from uh, the owners of the farm. It's just a name that you see. But Jordy, you know, the first day I'm on a, like a, a video conference with him, you know, talking with him face to face. And, you know, the guy he's shooting from, he's just on his end at his house, you know, just like, hey, what's up, man? You know, you know tell me a little bit about yourself. You know, what can we do for you? How can we help you? How would you like us to, how would you like us to market you? You know, what works for you? You know, it's, it's something that just makes you feel so comfortable because you're back in, you've got that bond with them, even though you may have never met them, you still like, you can, you, you understand each other and you work well together. And I think that's what, one of the main things that makes this company so successful and so such a great company to work with is how far these people are willing to go for you. I'm the quality control supervisor at Cormatech and uh, you know, I cover, and go through warehouses. We've got uh, five warehouses that I have to travel back and forth through, you know, depending on where we're receiving stuff, sending stuff out, you know, dragging the inventory or whatnot. So uh, I get to travel a lot between the different locations that, uh, you know, I help supervise there. Yeah, working with Seven Eagle was really a seamless experience for us. They did all the heavy lifting. Um, Mike and his team were just a pleasure to work with. Um, as far as hiring veterans, um, um, our, myself, like many people, when we see veterans in public, we tend to thank them for their service. 
This was an opportunity for our company to, to do more than just thank him. It was a chance to give Mike Dyer an opportunity to use the skills he learned in his service and bring them to our company for the benefit of our company. So we wish Mike um, the greatest career here and a long-term relationship with him. Uh, Mike's been a great addition to the team. He uh, fit in really well when he started. Um, he hit the ground running on any projects or any assignments we gave him. Um, he's also suggested several things we can improve already. Um, he's been a great addition to the team. He's a hard worker. Every day he, he brings 100%, which uh, we've seen out of veterans. We love that part of them. Um, they, don't, they don't slack off, <laughs> which is nice. And uh, he's just not one you have to watch closely. He, you can give him the job and he'll get it done. Things are going great now. They're going absolutely wonderful now. Uh, I'm, I really feel like I can see myself retiring from this place in you know, 40 years, if, if I live that long. Uh, you know, each family is great. Uh, we just had a baby uh, last year. She'll be a year old here in just about four weeks. So uh, kids are great. You know, life's great. Um, I really, I really feel confident about the future. Uh, I see myself going just unlimited potential in this future, you know, no, no ceiling as far as I can climb. No pressure. <laughs> You're terrible. <laughs>